Hi, I'm James from Roland, and I'm at Craft Music. And today we're going to take a look at a hybrid drum set we put together that's centered around the Roland TM6 Pro trigger module. The TM6 Pro is very flexible, both in terms of what types of triggers it accepts and how you can customize your setup. Today, we're using RT30HR triggers on the snare, the high tom, and the floor tom. We also have an RT30K trigger on the kick drum, a BT1 bar trigger here to my right, and a PDX8 pad on my left. As you can see, we have all the components mounted onto a four-piece Pearl acoustic kit. This kit is mic'd with an overhead pair of AKG 214s and a Shure Beta 52 on the kick. Let's take a listen to this kit using only the microphones. The TM6 Pro will be turned off. Now I'll bring in some of the triggered sounds from the TM6 Pro, playing the same groove so you can hear the difference. Let's dig into the features of the TM6 Pro. This module has six dual zone trigger inputs. This means you can connect six dual zone triggers or using a stereo Y cable, you can connect 12 single zone triggers. The TM6 Pro has 500 one-shot samples built into the module as well as over 250 V-drum sounds. These samples were recorded in top studios all over the world and covers a really wide range of sounds and textures. You can also use an SD card to import your own samples or play back audio files and backing tracks. The TM6 Pro is very easy to navigate and you don't have to do a lot of menu diving to get into the sounds. On the bottom of the module, you'll notice we have six buttons which correspond to the six inputs into the back of the module. This is where you can audition sounds and audition preset kits in the module. So if you want to audition a preset kit, all you have to do is tap through the buttons to see what sounds are in the preset. You'll also notice a rim button, and when you press that, you can audition the second zone of the trigger input. The plus or minus buttons will take you through the 80 preset kits, but if we want to customize our own kit, we'll just scroll up to a user kit, and I'll show you how to build your own sounds. So here we are on a blank user kit, and we'll go up to menu, and we'll go into instruments. Press enter, and you'll notice we have two menus here, an A menu and a B menu. This is where you can layer sounds. If you don't want to layer sounds, just leave the B menu blank. Let's start by selecting a kick drum sound. If we want to layer a sound, we scroll down to the B menu, turn that on, and we can scroll through sounds. Now let's pick a snare sound. We can either hit the second preview button or tap the snare drum. And now I'll show you how to add some reverb to the snare sound. To add reverb, we'll go to the menu, go over to Kit Effects, hit Enter, Reverb, Enter. Now we have some reverb dialed up, and if you want to send this to the snare drum, just hit the Send button, hit the snare, and bring up your levels. Now let's assign something to the bar trigger. 
It's worth noting that the TM6 Pro has a hi-hat control input, and I have an FD9 control pedal right next to the acoustic hi-hat stand. So if I want to place a hi-hat on the bar trigger, I can also control it with the foot pedal. Now let's layer that. So now we have a hi-hat layered with a hi-hat tambourine. You can also control the volume, pitch, decay, as well as the attack, release, and the multi effects from these three endless encoders. Let's talk about some applications for the TM6 Pro. If you're a drummer in a cover band and you want to authentically recreate the drum sounds from a certain record, if you're a drummer that wants to add some electronic sounds or some auxiliary percussion sounds to your setup, the TM6 Pro is a perfect module for that. It's also helpful to simply reinforce the acoustic sound of your kit. Whether you're playing on stage or recording, it's a great way to get a consistent sound for your drums. Speaking of recording, the TM6 Pro functions as an eight channel audio interface over USB. That means you can send eight channels of audio to your computer and record right into your DAW. You can also send eight channels of audio back into the TM6 Pro to monitor and play along. We also have a five pin MIDI output so you can work with external modules or other MIDI equipment. Let me give you a few more examples of the wide variety of sounds in the TM6 Pro. That wraps up the TM6 Pro. If you want to talk more about hybrid drumming or create your own custom bundle, feel free to contact Craft Music via email, phone, or live chat. Once again, I'm James from Roland. Thanks for checking out this video.